Well, this morning we have a very special guest joining us in studio. He may be small in size, but Sparky has been using his big heart and courage to make a difference in local schools. Not only did the Mighty Terrier keep schools safe by detecting drugs and gunpowder, but he created special bonds with the kids that he protected. And now the retired pup has been nominated for a big award, the 2018 American Humane Hero Dog Awards for being an ordinary dog doing extraordinary things. And Sparky is here. He joins us this morning along with uh, Kathleen Mager from Sherlock Hounds Detection Canine. So welcome to the show this morning. Thank you. Thank you for having us. And thanks for bringing Sparky. Yeah. Quite an or ordinary dog doing extraordinary things. Tell mm -hmm. us all about this and what his responsibilities were in school. Sure. So he worked for us for about nine years. He um, was trained to find drugs, alcohol, and gunpowder, and we are part of a proactive program to keep schools safe. Very cool. And yeah. you had mentioned to me in the commercial break a really special story about mm -hmm. a, an individual that he was able to interact with. Yeah, we had a young man come up to us who told us that basically he realized he had a problem using drugs and he didn't want to disappoint Sparky. And so he got help and got himself clean and told us he was going to head to college. and. I haven't kept in touch with him, but I hope he did all that. That sounds so great. great. So that actually was one stepping stone to him being nominated for this award, correct? It was, yeah. He, we felt like he should be nominated. He just connected with the hard-to-reach kids, and everybody loved him. He became my most requested dog when he was working, and the principals loved him, and he was just known to do his job really well. Very cool. So now, if he wins this award, does he get like a, life, a lifetime supply of biscuits or something? Or <laughs> what sort of is the award? I think he already has a lifetime supply of biscuits. <laughs> but if he wins, we get to go to L.A. and compete in the finals. And if he's one of the seven finalists, then we get $2,500 for our charity, which is Pets for Patriots. And should he win, they get an additional $5,000. And awesome. that's just a great organization. And what exactly is Pets for Patriots? Can you go into that charity a sure. little bit more? Sure. I chose them because they are an organization that takes homeless pets and puts them with veterans. So it just rang true to two things that are very important to me. Very cool. And now you guys obviously must have a lot of other dogs at Sherlock Hounds Detection mm -hmm. Canines that do a lot of work. Is it all within schools or other avenues? Usually it is within schools. We have five labs. So um, usually it's schools. We do have some private businesses that hire us. And we also have a drug and alcohol rehab that uses us. Very so, cool. Now, yeah. if somebody wants to vote for him to get this award, is there a way for them to do that? There is. They can go to the American Hero Dog Awards website, and under Emerging Heroes, you can find Sparky. And actually, in some of the other categories, you can vote in every category and once a day. And there's some other Colorado dogs, so I encourage people to look at all the categories. How cool. And yeah. Sparky, what are you up to now that you're retired, buddy? Does he, he have any like special hobbies or anything? <laughs> <laughs> he still loves to play, and he loves to oversee the uh, other drug dogs. It's really funny. I think he thinks he's as big as the labs, so he keeps them in line. Got and he it. rides shotgun with me to all the schools. and and just enjoy his going with. Very cool. Well, good luck to you, Sparky. Uh, hey, Greg, I know you were laughing back there, but dogs can have <laughs> hobbies too, can't yeah, they? they can, yeah. And Kirk and I came up with an impromptu list of dog hobbies that included uh, Kirk had coin collecting.